Okay. Um, good evening, everyone. Welcome to this. Uh, I think this is our official meeting. We had an unofficial meeting on WhatsApp uh, last month, and this should be the official meeting of the Kusa community. My name is Sadek Shahadu. And maybe we should introduce ourselves. So maybe your name, what you do, and where you are currently based. So as I said, my name is Sadek Shahadu. I'm currently based in Accra, but mostly in Tamale. And I am the executive director for the the Ghana Community and Suicide Group, which works to support the Burundi, Kusa, Omori, Dagari, and all the system of the Ghana languages on Wikipedia. And yes, that is all I can say about myself for now. I would like to pass it on to the next person, Engineer Mahmoud. I think my phone is coming to go low. So, next person can introduce themselves. Hello, good evening, everyone. Good evening. Yeah. Mit Nuruddin. Uh, I'm in Kumasi, based in Kumasi. I work here. I've been here for some time now. So, yeah. Okay. Next person. So, sorry, I was disconnected for a while. I don't know if Awini has spoken. Yeah, I've done that. Yeah, done that. Oh, okay. All right. Excellent. So, let's go straight to the um, so the first uh, reason why we are having this call is to officially launch the Kusal community and, and also to introduce ourselves to each other since the first one was unofficial and we did not get the opportunity to learn more about ourselves and at the same time help community members to create account and translate wiki. So this meeting will last for 30 minutes and we are going to be able to create account for ourselves for translate wiki and Wikipedia. I understand some of um, the committees or committee members have already created their account for Wikipedia, which is great. So now let's go to um, translate wiki. And I also want to uh, share that uh, we have finally added um, Kusa to the Translate Wiki platform. Translate Wiki platform is the uh, more like the power house for Wiki, Wikimedia projects. Before you start any Wiki, Wikipedia or test Wiki, you first of all need to create an account and do uh, some translations of the most commonly used messages on Media Wiki. So Translate Wiki is powered by Media Wiki interface and also um, supports all the wikis that we see with English, Dagwani, and all the other wikis we have, um, wiki, PDR sister projects like Wiki Voya, Wiktionary, uh, Wikimedia Commons, and all of that. So it is a very important place to be. And for a new community, Translate Wiki is the first uh, platform to get familiar with and also uh, make good use of. So to as we are hoping to create more um, Wikipedia for all the system of the one languages, it is important to first localize the interface, which is like having all the buttons that appears on Wikipedia, like translated in our own language. Um, some people have in the past created test wikis by just creating accounts and creating Wikipedia articles in their language, but you realize that most of the um, inf like the information on the interface are still in English. 
which is not the best. So imagine you open a Wikipedia article in your language and then you still see create an account, login, like uh, upload a file, main page, you know, all those things, talk page, preferences. They are not uh, supposed to be in any other language since it's your own language. So you should make sure everything has been translated in your own language. Uh, if you look at the Dagbani, for example, I think I should start sharing my screen. Let me share my screen. Just a second. I don't know why it's not allowing me to share it. No, it's good. It's mentioned. No, it's okay. I'm just going to share the screen so my team will see. So let's go to this page. Yeah. So this is the translate wiki page, the home page. First of all, I have to log it, log out. So this is all we need to be able to access the translate wiki interface. And then what we will need again is uh, the incubator for Husserl, which is this one. So I just created this article, but it's written in uh, English. Ghana is a country in West Africa. So this is how articles are created on, um, on the incubator for PUSA. And to be able to create, you see um, this domain or URL extension after you. So instead of going directly to Wikipedia, you have to be in the incubator, which is incubator.wikimedia, not Wikipedia, please take note. So you can just search it. Let me open this. Um, incubator, so we need up to this page. I will send it to the group later. Oh, I should just send it on and see. Drop it in the chat. No, oh, don't add it to Okay, so I will drop it like this. this. Is the incubator, and then here we have the translate wiki. I will drop that as well. Translate wiki interface main page. I'll drop that as well. Uh, so let me share my screen again. Okay. Okay. So this. Okay, so when you open a new tab, like when you type the DAG, so if you are already on the main page, like when Wikipedia English has en.wikipedia.org. So if you look at the English interface, you see that everything is in English, main page, content, current event, random about Wikipedia, contact us, donate, uh, talk, sandbox, preferences, beta, watch list, contribution, logout, and then your username. So all these things you see here, all the way down on the far left, you see languages all through to the bottom, even at the bottom here, everything you see here is what we need to translate. But how do you translate it? So all that you see here, main page, talk, read, uh, view source, view history, search Wikipedia, contribute, a contribution, 
watch list, everything you see here should be lo uh, localized into uh, Pusa language. So it's a, a lot of efforts. And these are just a few, uh, like most, that's why I say the most important messages on media wiki. So these are the most important things you need to have your local language Wikipedia uh, localized. But there are many other things that needs to be translated that we may not be looking at at this point because uh, we don't need them for now. But these are the most important ones. There are a lot, about uh, hundreds of them. If you look at here, you see only a few of them. Even this text below here, the very, the very bottom, you see footer. This text is licenses under Creative Commons attribution share alike. This is the license term that uh, governs Wikipedia. So all these things need to be translated in your own language. Privacy policy about disclaimer, contacts, mobile view, everything you see here will need to be translated. Wikipedia languages. So how so do starting you... starting the network was bad. I don't know if you, you have moved so fast that I don't even get to know the initial stage. Uh, Okay, the network was so, okay okay so i was showing you the i don't know where you left us but so this is the first place you have to log into this um so i sent two links in the whatsapp group which is the translate wiki and then the kusal wikipedia uh, incubator so mm. but right now what i'm doing is that i'm just showing you how the english wikipedia is the interface oh, okay. and the messages, what we call mm -hmm. the commonly used uh, messages on Media Wiki. So if you look at these things, they are all in English on the English Wikipedia, talk page, mm -hmm. sandbox, references, all these messages, log out, search Wikipedia, view source, read, talk, you know, everything you see here, help, learn to edit, everything needs to be translated into your own language, but you cannot come here and do the translation. What you need to do is to go directly to another platform called translatewiki.net. Once you begin mm. to translate things in, in by selecting the language, it will reflect on the page as we are translating it. Other than that, people have created this okay. and they are still reflecting in English, which is which, which is not good. Because if you say you want to create your language Wikipedia, everything should be should reflect your language like the Dagbani. So I, I also wanted to show you the Dagbani. But so first of all, first of all, if we are going, if you want to go in, where, which place do you go first? So the first place you need to go is the Translate Wiki. So let me just show you the Dagbani as, as, as an example. So this is the Dagbani. When I was looking at the English, you see that here has main page. Now we have mm. changed it to solo out. Here has Lehmetare view history. Karma read, shower gabu, you know, discussion page, malnan mm -hmm. edits, malnan de yifshina. No. So this one is edit source, yelma talk, yima log, log out to have a contribution. You see that we have localized all these things on the mm -hmm. So this is exactly what you do. And as I said, to do that, Everything here has now been localized into the brand. You see this uh, license that was in the English. Now it has been localized in the brand. For example, here it says text is available under Creative Commons attribution share alike. When you go to the brand, you see that Sabuma Biela Creative Commons attribution share alike. Get to Amukpala Neto Biene Nyama Zaisi. And everything that you see here to reflect in Dagbani. Ashil Zalkbana, that's privacy policy. And here, mm. everything has been localized. Cook, cookies, cookies yet to ah. You see how you are going to do everything here has to be localized. And to do that, you have to be at this place, translatewiki.net. And I was saying okay. that, yeah, so this is the first point of call if you want to have your language. Translate Wiki first. So you just go to translatewiki.net and then create an account if you have an existing account. So to become a translator, usually what happens is that the, the administrators need to verify that you are you speak the language. 
they need to understand that you are a native speaker before they will approve you. But luckily for us, usually you have to even do like, we just go and start creating, like translating few things for somebody to review it and now make mm -hmm. you like an authorized translator. You understand? So for me, when I started translating, because it's my language, I was just translating it small, 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 small. Before somebody saw that I was translating and then they came to approve me as a, like an approved translator. Here you see that I've become a translator. So you can start translating without being approved, which means you cannot translate certain things. You can only do like some few things, limited changes you can do, but not really into translating everything in your land because you are not approved. But now that we have communities and we have built relationship with the platform, we have somebody who is one of the administrators who has uh, like approved the translator. So when, when, when you create your account, you just need to, to, to go there and do like two, three translations or so, and then send your user and then we can forward it to the administrator to approve you quickly. But usually under normal circumstance, you are going to be able uh, to, to be translating so many things before they will approve you. But if you have created your account here, just share with me, I will forward to the administrator, you just do some two, three translations, and then they will give you, they will grant you tra uh, translator rights on Kusal. So first of all, if you have not created your account, you can create it here right away by clicking here to create your account. Once you click here, if you don't have an account, you have, you'll be able to create it, or you just go straight to enter your account details, username, password and email. So what has worked for me is that because most people forget their username and passwords, I use the same Wikipedia, um, uh, what's the name? Account I've created to, to create my translate kit, like the same username, the same password so that I don't forget it and the same email. But all the same, there are different platforms. You can decide to choose another, um, you know, uh, username and password, which is very different from your Wikipedia. It's totally acceptable, just that you may be forgetting it or something. But my advice is that choose any name that you like or you want to use the same Wikipedia, but just make sure that um, the username is memorable and your password is memorable as well. So you can just go ahead to create your account by typing your name, username, password, and then your email here. Then you click on create. So that is it because I have, so look at here, Translate Wiki open source translation community. It has over 59, about 59 projects. It has about 15,000 translators. And then it has over 131,000 messages to translate. I already told you that there are thousands of messages be translated in your language, which you cannot uh, do at, at a go. So you start by translating the most important messages on media, which, which is the one that we see on the English Wikipedia interface. So those are the top most important things to translate. So when, we, you, log, when you log in, you are going to see, are they going to, uh, forgive my ignorance, but are they going to give you something to translate? Or you yes. pick up what yes, so they will bring the most most commonly used messages on translate wiki. So once oh. I click on login, let me log in and see. So this is my username and password. Okay, so I'll enter my password. So I'm, I'm logged in now. Because I've been granted a translator right, I can review people's translation for Dagbani. I can translate right away. You can as well. But what you need to do first is to create your user page. So if I log in with my username and power, you see that here is blue because I've created my page. So if you're, mm. you have just created your account for the first time, it will be red probably. 
So to create it, you need to let translate wiki know that you are a native speaker of that language first. So I, I'll click on, I'll just click on my username, then it will bring me this. So these are important um, information they have, have added to my page. These are important informations I've added to my page. But if you are joining here for the first time, you see that most used, most important. If I click on this place, it will take me to the most important things that I can just start translating right away. Messages that needs updating or fixing. See? The bevel, bevel here, I'll show you. Uh, let's not go to the translate. So now, what do you need to know about this place? Once you click on your username, it locks in here. You see user, that's my username. If somebody wants to message me, they will come to discussion here. If they want to send something, tell me something or chat with me or something, they will just post their message here. See that this person has sent me a banner. It's like a thank you for coordinating translation, translation of the most used messages into Dagban. So this is like a, a plug they've sent me, like an award or something. So yeah that's a discussion page which we don't need at this point so now let me go back to the user page in my user page you see this thing um, you see here en and native this user has a native understanding of english this user has a native understanding of dagbani kus this user has a native understanding of kusa you see even though i don't understand Pusa, but because i am coming to teach you, I've added it as my language, Gruni, in that order. So you, you after creating your account, you first of all need to create your user page by just clicking on the, as I said, this page, it will be red. So you have to click on it to be able to get to this page. So when you click on it, don't worry about these messages, all these things that are there. The most important thing is to add this Babel information. So, then I'll send the Babel information to the chat for all of you to copy and just paste it in your uh, top page. So let me go back. Um, I'm back again. So after logging in, as I said, I'm just re 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 going back again. You click on this place, you hover to the top, your username, after you have logged in, you see your username reflecting here. It will be red if it's the first time you are creating. You have just created your account. Creating your account is different from creating a user page. So I click on the name like this. Then I'll make sure I, I, I paste this bevel that I'll send to all of you. Just paste it in, the, in here. So I'll click on edit. You see how it is? Everything has been summarized to like this, something like this. I've added my location where I'm located. So maybe it's also important for you. But you may not need a uh, Dagbani or Kusa, um, Bruni or Dagari or whatever. All you need is just make sure that this code has column EN column, then just put Ku, Kus for Kusa without putting the Bruni and whatever. So I'm just going to send this to you. So this thing to, I think you should add all of this to your page. So let me send it to all of you. No, I've deleted this thing. Okay. Hold on. So yeah, so this is what I'm going to send to you. I'll send this to you. Then just paste. You yeah, are just pasting it in your page, the user page. So I'll send it to you later. So after cre creating your account and logging in, you need to click, click on your username, which will be red. Once you click on your username, it will bring this interface for you. See that it's editable. There's bold, italic, add a link, insert a picture. Then just paste the whole of this on it and click publish. You paste this thing and click. This is a minor edit. Here you can say created a page or user page. You just write your summary, what you have done, and then click on save. Once you click on save, you see what is showing on my page, user page, just like your own exactly like this you will now see like that and what you are what it also means is that you are telling translate wiki that you are a native speaker of kusa language 
which means you speak the language. So now you'll be able to um, translate in that language. Does this make sense? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so let me go back to the home page. Now here, if I, after logging in, I can now just come here and translate. I'll just click on translate. Translate to what? You see, it says to English, I have to change the language. If you are a Kusa, I don't know, we, even though we added the Kusa and Dagar, but I'm only seeing Dagari and not Kusa. You see that Dagari is here, Dagari. Uh. Let me check again. So Kusal, Kusal, I don't know whether it is using that letter that looks like you, but not you or something. <laughs> no, no, it's, it's the same thing. Okay. So I'm not you. seeing Kusal, but I'm seeing Dagari. Dagbani is here. You see that I can translate to Dagbani. I can... Don't be confused about this. I will show you later. There's Dagari. If I was to translate to Dagari. Oh, I saw Dagari somewhere. Where is it? Hold on. Now, this is Dagari. This is Dagari. So if I was translating to Sorry. Dagari, you see that it has switched the language, translate to. You just click on this drop down and then select your language. You can yeah, say is here. Have you seen it? Uh -huh, I've now seen yeah. you use you use the wrong alphabet. Uh -huh. No, so what they've added here, that means the script is different. So you have to take notes. If you are adding a keyboard, make sure the keyboard is using this one, not you. Do you understand? Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. So now I've switched to my hard white translate view the forum, forum page. How will you say it in, in Kusa? view the forum page. <laughs> so this is where the problem is, because it, you may be like a native speaker, but when it comes to translate wiki, you need like a, you need to have a consensus. You need to have a language expert, somebody who has like a master uh, M, M field or PhD. Network is bad. Can you hear me now? This is the interesting part. I don't want you to miss yeah, it. Not your line is breaking. I don't know what is here. Uh, who else can hear me? Yes, I will me. I can hear you. Okay, so I'm sure maybe you are having an issue, um, Mahmoud. So now, you see that I've now tr uh, tr uh, switched my language to, to Kusa. What it means, because I've added mm -hmm. Kusa to my talk page, if you don't add it, it will never come in your language uh, here. It may be there, but it may come, but you know they will not allow you to translate because you didn't say that you are a native speaker or you have a, an understanding of the language. Do you understand? So make sure after creating your account on Translate Wiki, click on your user account, paste the code that I'll send to you and publish or save changes. Then it will show that you are now a native speaker of the language. Then you hover back again to translate. Then select the language to push off. That is all. And you are good to go. So now, whatever I'm going to type in this box should reflect the top here. So I, this is what I'm translating. View the forum page. I'm translating it into Kusa language. So how will I say that in Kusa? That is the problem. So this is what untranslated. Here you see outdated. Here you see all pages. So you, it depends on what you want to translate first. For me, nothing to translate for outdated because there hasn't been any translation. All pages, let me see what is there. All pages, uh -huh. all pages has these things. Now there's also what? Uh, untranslated, untranslated will also give you this. But somebody may ask what if I don't understand what exactly they want me to translate. You can switch, you can skip, you see, skip to next. I can simply skip to next. What is forum in Kusa? How will you describe forum? In, in, from English to Kusa, how will you say forum in Kusa? Does anybody have any idea? I really should have an idea. <laughs> okay. So it is not as, I, I must tell you, it is not as easy. Even when, when we are doing it, we even include like 
people with uh, like high level of their language, but you have to think twice before sure. you come out because that language, this particular thing is not common in our language, like computer. We had nothing like that before. So how do you see, give computer name in your language? Forum, there's nothing like that ever. So how do you create it yeah. in your language? So it's like we are now doing something that nobody has done before. And we have to make sure that whatever we are doing is, is the right thing or it has been accepted by all of us. So that's why you need somebody to review it. So if, um, for example, I've given um, a different name for Kusa uh, in Kusa for forum, which may not be correct. Another person can come and edit it to make a correction for it. It is not permanent. Everything that we do here is not permanent. Somebody can always come and review it and see that no, how you translated it, it doesn't connect well. So how would you say create create account on Kus, uh, in Kusa create account? Account may still be a same name like Dagban, for example. They say Yome account. You see that we don't have a sing, single name for the word account, so we can just twist. It's it's, it's almost it's almost the pronunciation is the same, but just that the tonation. Uh -huh. uh, the, the, the name. Uh -huh. So it is the same thing. You should also adapt it like that. So, so there are certain things, terminologies that no matter how you try to do it, you cannot translate it like account. You can only say account. Even the Ashanti people, they say account. Other languages, I've seen major languages adapt. They just change the spelling. So instead of A-C-C-O-U-M, Empty. Sorry, sorry, I am I am trying I'm trying to create the account. You are saying me I don't have permission or something. You are creating on translate wiki. Yeah. Uh, that's strange because for account creation, everybody should be able to create an account. For account creation, you should be able to create once you go to translatewiki.net, the first page you see is login or create an account. Then you yes. create an account. We'll figure that out to see what exactly the issue is. You saw that when I- All right, I'm able to do that. All right. Yeah, you'll be able to do that, I'm sure. So now- I've, I've, been able to create, I've been able to create now. Excellent. So now, you see what I was saying? To, to be able to get all the 1,000 messages translated, it's not easy. Login, how will you say login sure. in your oh, language? So, so uh, Sadiq, uh, this one, let me let me just be very clear here. I have done mine, and, and what I'm seeing here is the red you talked about, the name uh -huh. with the red. Uh, okay. okay, so click so, on the red. You see that it will open like you are creating something. Then you paste what I'm going to send to you right now. So I've, clicked, I've clicked the red, but nothing has opened. I only see there is no current, there is currently no text in this page. Uh, so hold on. Can you share your screen? Uh, I'm using I'm using my you laptop. Can... I'm using my phone. My laptop giving me problem. So okay. So if you could share your screen, I could guide you. But once you click on the red thing, there's a place to create a page. If you look through carefully, either it is opening, it's going to open the box for you, or there's a place to to click and it will say like maybe create this page. Or something like that. There should be something that you you see in that uh, information they will provide there after clicking the red. And then once you figure that one out, either how do you like, create create translator or something? Uh -huh, something like that. When you click on the red uh, the red um, button, which is your name reflecting in red. Once you click on it, there should be something that will say create something. Then you just paste what I'm going to to show you. Uh, I'm going to send to you. Let me send it to you. I'm coming. So you see, this is this is what I'm seeing. Let me just show you. I'm not able to see your screen. So, uh, so I'm sending this one to your your page. What you need to just do is to delete. Uh, uh, let me just delete everything for you so that you have only Kusa reflecting. 
and so I'll paste this. Trying to show you. So you see, this is what I, I get now. You see? Are you this showing your screen? I'm just showing you through my uh, phone. Okay, okay. So, okay. So, can you, did you user page? When you click on it, you see that this, your user page, page does not exist. You see? See, there's so create, you... create, there's below the text. Have you seen something like create? To create, I'm seeing something. To no, there's this. no create. See the text below. There's currently. Who is calling me? Yeah, no, you can search for this page title in other pages or search related blog blocks, but you do not have the permission. You do not have permission to create this page. Okay. Okay. So let's go. Let's forget about the page now. I'll, I'll figure things out to, to be able to allow you to create it, but you should be able to translate without having the page created. Just that the text, um, the, 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 what's the name? Uh, so I have, I have come to this, I've gone to discussion. Mm -hmm. So you don't need discussion now. So now that you can use a page, uh, you are creating a user talk, click on the user page, user page. So if you are going to create your user page, not the discussion, the other one. Yes, the yes, user page. Uh -huh. So ideally, this is where you'll be able to paste the code that I'm going to send to you. Let me set, drop it here. But there's no, there's no IE, there's no any provided yeah, so, feature. So don't worry, forget, forget about that one. Don't worry about it. Now let's go straight to uh, translate. Have you seen the, when you log in the first page, there's say translate. Yeah. Have you seen to English? You switch it to uh, Usao. Translate. When I log in earlier. Yeah, yeah. You should see at the top, English. Uh -huh. Then yes, you just switch it. Have you seen Kusao? Now searching because the the thing has changed. Mm. A keyboard. Yeah, the, that thing that looks like you know. But I think when yeah. you when you look through the, don't search. Just click on drop the language and if dropping down. Scroll. You should see to mm -hmm. somewhere. It would have been easier to search. You will see it. Even if you don't see it now, it should show very soon. And then uh, once you select that, now I wish you could see it and we'll just demonstrate with your account so that it'll be easier for you to see. Other than that, we'll just pause and then I'll demonstrate it for you after the language is selected from my computer. I'm coming. Can't find it. Can't find it. You can't find it. It will come. You see, that I was also struggling to find it till it came. So don't worry. Yeah, it's yeah. already there. So we, let's just move straight okay, to the me. next, the next step. So can I proceed with the translation? Yeah. Okay. I'm coming.
So let me come back and share my screen. Now let's go back to sharing screen. Now the translation with regards to translation, look at, you can choose to translate what they are showing. You see all untranslated, outdated, translate. You can just click on any of them then to show you what is there. Translated, there's nothing, no translated messages. Nobody has translated anything at all. So I click on translate as the first person to, to do the first ever translation. Unfortunately, I don't understand the language. So, but you have to check the tenor because if, if we check, if we go to, I what do you call it? This, you're searching the languages for you to write on, you are not seeing the input. Mm -hmm. Are you talking about the language? The language setting, yeah. Me, my own is already set to Kusan. After clicking the drop down, I just clicked on the drop down and I saw Kusan. Okay. So you should also see it. If you don't see it now, you see that when I also started, I didn't see it until I tried a couple of times and it came. So it, it will come because it's already added. It's already added. So maybe after the call, you can try it. So there's no way, there's no way the, the because of the keyboard, there's no way that you can can change. That's how the the language code, the ISO code is. You see, but okay. what you are doing here is just you don't need it. It's just searching, searching for it. But in the writing can be you, but this is what uh per the you know that um all the languages have their own characters, uh, special characters. Bruni has some characters, even though they are all like Moli languages, Bruni has some characters that Dagbani doesn't use. In the same way, Kusal can also have. This thing that you, looks like you used to be there long ago. So when in terms of translation, you don't need it. You just need to identify it as the name reflect on translate wiki and you are good to go. So here, now let's come to, uh, you see there, there are other, other messages here. Can you see them as I'm scrolling? I seen them. Can everyone see my screen? See here, all these things, logins, page visits, in relation tools, can you all see it? Oh, I can hear. Yes, it. I can see. Uh huh. So, can you see here cancel? So, how yes. do I say cancel in Kusa? How do I say cancel? Sam. Sa. Mm. Can you type it in the chat or just spell it for me so I can translate that one at least for the first ever translation? Okay, uh, S A A M. Okay, S A A M. So oh, I'm translating. You, can, you I'm, can add this. You can add this one, Sam Bus. Like the bus should also add it to be added. Cancel. And Sam Bus. Can you, then you should type it in the chat, the uh, Zoom chat, so that I can copy and paste just, it. Just, just add, uh, add. It's M, not L. Okay, M. Ba, yes. like this. Bas, S. Sambas. Yes. Okay, so let's assume this is correct. Somebody may come and argue that no, it is not like that. So the person can edit it. So now I've just made like the first ever translation. What I need to do is to just click on publish translation. Can you see that? Yes. Then I click on publish. So now we have one translation. Change text size. How do you say it? So I can either, either be following this one that they have they've been predicting for me, or I just scroll down to what I think I can translate. Like small. How do you say small? In, in Kusa, regular, depth. There are a bunch of them, hundreds and thousands of them. So we need to translate everything like this. I see. Do you, do you understand? So this is where the work begins. And everything that you are okay. translating here, 
it automatically be added to your Wikipedia page. This one is connected to the page that you'll be building in future. So you don't need to move mm. anything here. You are just doing it here and it, it will automatically send it to the incubator. Do you understand? All right. So, so, how, so, so how, how is it, like, are they, for instance, I, uh, I don't know how, I just, I don't know how that will be done because if I am creating uh, my accounts here, and I'm doing all of these things. How does it get to? Uh, do we have a main server where, uh, server where someone ensure or approve whatever uh, translation you make? And are you talking about where somebody can see all the translations? Mm -mm. It's all here. See the ones that I just translated. When I come to translate it, you will now see one thing there. At first, it was zero. Now I've translated cancel to Sambas. You see that it's now showing. You see here, translated, outdated, untranslated, all. So if you want to know, see all the things that have been translated, you just click on translated. Then you see them. Everything that has been translated already will now be lined up here. So even here, that's why I say, if they make it so strict that nobody can edit it, it it's not going to be good. It should be something that is open. So now, even what I've done here, anybody can come and change it. I can still review it and change it that it's not like this. Or anybody can come. It can be changed as much as possible. You understand? So all, yeah. we, need, all we need to do is to translate it to the right um, um, meaning. Knowing very well that other people will see it and make changes to it if they, they think it is not the right thing. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. So we shouldn't be worried about where everything is saved here. Everything is, is, is already stored here. It's, it's stored here and anybody can see it. Anybody can make changes to it. That's how Wikipedia is built collaboratively. Anybody should be able to make changes. So untranslated, it will show you a lot of messages that are not translated, as you can see here. See, you are in. Yeah. If you want to translate, you are. You have, have you seen the edit button with the pencil? Are yes. you seen here? Just on that same line, mm. you have to click on the pencil like edit. Okay, how will you say okay in 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 uh, in Kusa? So when you go to translate, make sure you are translating the the simplest ones. Everything that you are translating here will be very useful to your Wikipedia. Without these things translated, you can't have a Wikipedia. There's no way. And when you are translating it, it's stored on its own server. You don't need to type, copy and paste anything. It will be added to the page, like how this Dagbani has been moved here. We didn't move it here. We just did the translations here and then all reflected here. The same way the English too. So how will you say, okay, the, the, the translation there, there are many, no. as, as you saw, 130 something thousand translations that are available, but you need to do the most important ones, which are the ones that I'm just showing you here. All these ones are the most important ones. Do you understand? Yeah. Okay. So I'm, I'm doing this training with the hope that the two of you will understand it and then organize separate like training to, to help people navigate through the interface. Or those who watch this session may have the opportunity to understand this, how translation is done. So this is our first call. And now people may want to, to translate right away. They should just create their account, select the language to, like, but if they cannot create their page, it's, it's okay, it's totally fine. But you make, make sure you have translated. Uh, switch. It's, it's, been, it's been difficult locating the language you <laughs> yeah, have been language, trying. Uh, you're still not uh, able to find it. You are not able to find it. Then. Uh, you will find it because it's there. I also, I also try it. Let me see. Try it again. Let me see. Me. Mm. Okay. So I, if I search here, it's already there. Special. No, first, where do you go? I didn't go anywhere. I'm going back to home. So 
when you log in first, this is what you see, isn't it? Yeah. You can see translate. You should see like this translate. Then I click on translate. Then the default is what? To English. But they say the source language of this group is English. Please, please select another language to translate. Then I come to switch. Click on switch. Then I see Dagari. I see Kusal. Have you seen all this? They're special. The ones that are special, they're suggested, they're special, there's worldwide. Make sure you are, you are under special. There's worldwide, there's America, there's, uh, you see that they have titles. There's another one that has Europe, Europe, European languages. Let me see. Maybe there should be, maybe it should be under Kusal if it's not special, uh, under Africa. So let's go and look for Africa. The languages are many, actually. There's Middle East. There's Africa. I've just gone past. Is it Africa I passed? No, Middle East. So, so, so you can you can now send the, the thing to me. Let me see. Yeah, there's Africa. Which link are the, you talking about? What you said I should paste or? Uh, OK, I've sent it to the group, the WhatsApp group. Where, where did you say we should paste? Your name, where the, your name is read. Okay. You click on that. I think you tried and you were not able to create your page. And I said, uh, you were, like, I hardly can see your screen, but under normal circumstance, when you click on your name like this, because I've already created my own, I, I just see it directly. But if you log in and you click, if you could share your screen with me very well, then I would have been able to guide you. But as I said, do not worry about that. You can immediately start translating if you are not able to add your your language. The only thing they will make it look like you are not a speaker of the language. Uh, so um, this call will end in uh, two minutes. So any question about transfer, I've not even introduced you to the incubator yet, but I've sent the link to the incubator. Now, any question on translate wiki? The next call will be on incubator. Any question? I think I will also have to try and then if there is any question, I'll ask later. Okay. So, uh, what do you call it? I think we have the keyboard, the, the keyboard stuff. So maybe we can. Are you able to find that that letter that you looks like uh, the character that looks like you? Uh, no. Yes. I'm... It should be there. We yeah. have. You have one on your PC, have, right? I have one on my phone. My phone. Mm -hmm. No, so not on should... phone. I have one on my phone, but I'm talking about the PC. Talking about oh, the PC, okay. it will be a problem because PC, there's another way, a completely different way to have it enabled on your PC, which we will deal, we will deal with later. Okay. But for now, I'll advise you to use um, mobile phones to translate, you can go ahead and be using your, but it's easier to even translate on your mobile phone. Like even when you are in a bus, you are somewhere, you just see all the things listed and then you click on translate and uh, edit and you are doing it like that. But I will show you another way to have the, uh, what's the name? If I click on translate, another way to translate to Pusal and type the characters in Dagban in, in those special characters. I will show you how it is done. That's another. You see here, if you, if you type here, you see that it has Dagbani tilde. But I will show you how it is done. There are many other languages you can add to it. 
But let's not bother ourselves with that. It's a stage by stage work. But for now, I advise you use uh, your keyboard on um, on your mobile phone. You can install okay, uh, so, uh, Anna key. You can install Keyman. Yeah, there are a lot of. Let me key. ask. It. Yes, I have completed one. I... Uh -huh. So the translations are many. You have to do as much as you like. You can. And everybody has to. If you, if you see something that you are not sure of your translation, just leave it or skip. So ch check this one. Check, check this one. I've sent you something on WhatsApp. Check. Okay. Go camp for uh, have you seen it? Uh, what what was it translated from? Uh, it's very dark, very dark. I can't see it. What did you translate as go? Go camp or go camp. Go. That is, they give the word go. Ah, uh, then you do camp. Uh huh. Ah, uh, okay, okay, cool. All right, so let me see translated. If I go to, to see if I will see. Yes, yeah, there is something like that translated. Okay, so let me go to translated. I have to see. So, I'll select. So if you want to see Kusal, when you open the languages, make sure you go to the special. There's one that has special. That's where you see Kusal. So I'm going to translate that to see whether your own is, is, is there. Translate Um, review translation. It's not even added on review, but let's see. Hopefully, it will that will be added. You can't find it then. Eh? Oh, but it's indicated here that it's translated. Uh, it will be reviewed. So, but me, I'm seeing my own here. Uh, unreviewed, let me see, unreviewed. I can't find it. So let's hope that all of them will come. As I said, you have to translate as much as possible before they will approve you as a translator on Translate Wiki. It takes a while, but if you are able to do a few, I can make them grant, uh, grant you access to be a translator quickly so that you can do more. So, you should also send me your username exactly how you created it. It's case sensitive, so just send it exactly as it is. And I encourage everyone to create their account. And then I'll make sure I upload this video so that those who want to watch can watch it and then uh, translate. Also, um, maybe the next training, you can do guide them. You can do a, a demo of how you are doing the translation. Okay. I think I think because I have not changed it to Kusal, that's why you said where can we find the Kusal? Kusal, have you switched to translate? When you are on the translate, you see that. Sorry. Hello, um, um, you are saying something. You see, where I'm, can on, we find I'm on the main page like this. After logging in, you see translate. You can't see my screen. Yes, I can see. I'm talking yeah, so, about the Kusal. So if you click on translate, it will now show you the language. Which language are you translating to? It's already in English. Then you click on English, where there's English. Yeah. Then drop down. 
you, it will bring you suggested languages, special languages. So I think Dagari and Kusal is under special. Have you seen the title the here? Uh, what's the name? The subtitle, special. Can you see it here? Uh, I'm here to share it. I have not seen. I'm no, only look, seeing. At what I... look at my screen here. Yes. Yes, what, I'm, what I'm seeing here first, I saw the, what I'm seeing is the worldwide. All of them are uh, there, worldwide is there. You just need to scroll down or up. There's Europe, there's Africa, there's Middle East, there's Persia. So I think uh, Kusal and Dagari is currently ca categorized under Persia because they have just added them. So special, you should see special. Just scroll down to see. But as I said, it's not when I also started, I didn't see the Kusa. It may take you um huh? a to get Kusa added. Uh, to, to, to see Kusa reflected. I really need to go from here. So in setting the language. Just search again with your mobile phone when you log in. Scroll through all the languages. Scroll, make sure you are under special. If you don't see special, you can go to uh, Africa. They are all categorized. Or just be scrolling through all of them till you see K, Kusa. Or if you can type the character K and then that, that character. It's very good. It's not easy getting the character, seeing the character. Okay. I've said, said, said. So just, I, I, the languages are more, just go through all of them, it's added. It could also be because of the page, maybe because you so, have not- Someone has just joined and there's a noise at the background. Please, can you mute your- So, so now, um, Awini, I don't know if you are also successful with the selection of the the language are, are you there okay uh, i'm on zoom because i have to listen very well before i go and create okay okay so i create my username but i'm here to go to the uh, language site okay okay so i'm currently at the... okay so as i said once you log in you, you are on the main page like this. You can always click on the translate wiki logo to be on the main page where you see translate. Then you click on translate. You will see by default it's to English. Then click on the drop down. You should see the special uh, hundreds of languages. You just use a drop down to scroll, scroll like this oh. until you find Kusa categorized under either special or Africa. Does this make sense? There are hundreds and thousands of languages. So just set through to make sure you are, you are typing it may not give you the exact because of the character, but just go through carefully. You should see it because it, it's been added. If you don't see it, as I said, log out and log in again. Definitely you see it. It could be from your phone or maybe just because you have just logged in. But that is where you find the language. Once you find it and you click on the language, it will switch to that language, right? Then you see now where you are supposed to translate. I really have to go from here. So I've selected, we've done one and one hour, 10 minutes. So once I select my language, I should see all the translations here. Either I use the, the predictive, predictive ones, which is at the top here, by typing my responses, view the forum, I'll just type my response in Kusal here and click on publish. I can skip if I'm not sure of that to bring another one. I can keep skipping, 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 skipping. Or you scroll down here. There are a bunch of them listed here. You just click on edit. As you can see, the pencil-like icon, you click on it and you are able to uh, edit. There are hundreds of them. Make sure you, you, you only edit what you can you can you understand. Okay, thank you so much.
I will end this call here. And if you have any question, you can reach out to me. Well, my question I'm, is, I've, I've still not been able to find it, so. You have not been able to find it. Yes, you will find it. But I'll, if I get any other ways to get you find, uh, to, to where you can find the language very easily, I will let you know. But for now, just know that it is added, as you can see. I don't know exactly what the issue is on your phone, but try with your laptop, maybe, or just I'm using my laptop. Okay, so it should be there. You know, when I also started, I wasn't seeing it. And where you create your username to, if you click on the red, and there's a way to create your username. I also figured that out as well. All right, thank you so much. And I will give you um, the feedback with regards to getting the language easier and also adding your native language to your user talk page. All right, see you. Bye-bye. All right. All right. Thank you. Okay. And then everyone should be able to, to create their account for now. So you please encourage everybody to create their account so that in our next meeting, people will start translating as soon as possible. Okay. <laughs>